Welcome to a presentation on vitreum macular traction brought to you by your neighborhood doctors. Please remember that we will cover the topic in general terms. Please consult your doctors for specific questions pertaining to you. Vitreum macular traction is like a rubber band that is stuck to the back of your eye. The vitreous gel, which is a jelly-like substance that fills the back of your eye, can sometimes stick to the macula, which is the part of your eye responsible for sharp vision. This creates tension on the macula, like a rubber band being pulled tight. This tension can cause blurry vision and other vision problems. Vitreum macular traction VMT, is a condition in which the vitreous gel, which is the clear gel that fills the back of your eye, pulls on the macula, which is the part of your eye responsible for central vision. Symptoms of VMT can include blurred vision, distorted vision, and difficulty reading or seeing fine details. You may also experience a decrease in color perception or difficulty adapting to changes in light. In some cases, you may experience flashes of light or floaters in your vision. If you experience any of these symptoms, it is important to contact your doctor right away for an evaluation. Vitreum macular traction VMT, is a condition that affects people of all ages, but it is more common in adults over the age of 50. It is also more common in women than men. People with diabetes, high myopia, nearsightedness, and those who have had cataract surgery are at an increased risk for developing VMT. Additionally, people with a history of retinal detachment or other eye diseases may be more likely to develop VMT. Vitreum macular traction is caused by an abnormally strong attachment between the vitreous gel and the macula, which is the part of the retina responsible for central vision. This attachment can be caused by a variety of factors, including age-related changes in the vitreous gel, trauma to the eye, inflammation in the eye, or a complication from eye surgery. In some cases, there may be no identifiable cause. Treatment for vitreum macular traction VMT, depends on the severity of the condition. In mild cases, your doctor may recommend a watch and wait approach, where you will be monitored closely to see if the condition improves on its own. In more severe cases, your doctor may recommend a procedure called vitrectomy. This is a surgical procedure that involves removing the vitreous gel from the eye and replacing it with a gas bubble or silicone oil. This helps to release the traction and reduce any associated symptoms. Your doctor may also recommend laser therapy to help break up any scar tissue that is causing the traction. This can be done in combination with a vitrectomy or as a standalone treatment. Finally, your doctor may prescribe medications such as corticosteroids or anti veg drugs to help reduce inflammation and improve vision. It is important to discuss all of your treatment options with your doctor so that you can make an informed decision about which option is best for you. The prognosis of vitreum macular traction is generally good. In most cases, the traction resolves on its own without any treatment. However, if the traction persists for more than six months, it may lead to complications such as macular hole formation or retinal detachment. If these complications occur, they can cause permanent vision loss. Therefore, it is important to monitor the condition closely and seek prompt medical attention if any changes in vision occur. Thank you for listening to this presentation brought to you by Talking Raymond. For information, check us out retinally.com info. Be safe. Love you.